give you another chance to be interesting. Go ahead. Well, I can scratch <laughs> what's what's else? your talent? I like to drink this. mango Arizona tea, something <laughs> like talent? that. Uh, All right. Talent. <laughs> and actually, you make Trace leches cake. Yes, I do. Is that your thing That's that you do for Valhalla? Uh -huh. That's awesome. Because I love Trace leches cake. Absolutely. All right. All right. Thanks. Hey, Robbie. How's it going? Robbie's like, oh man, I don't have any. Good. You know, I'm not interesting. <laughs> Okay, so what's, com what's coming up in trade stock? Um, we and we're, we're not, not going to show you the processing table because <laughs> it is a wreck. Um, yeah. Some, a dark we, elf okay. army that's coming through. A dark elf army? Yeah, a dark elf army. It just cool. was here in the studio and we're going to put it up. So that's All right, about great. right now. Okay, and uh, so Necrons and we have trades coming in. Uh, we we're accepting trades now. Yeah, we are. Yeah. We need lots more trades. So. All right, fantastic. Thanks, Robbie. Yeah. Okay, uh, Studio Necrons, I guess a version of this, uh, is on the web store right now. It's, um, this is probably 4,000 points, going to say. I know, oh. isn't that amazing? And uh, so I'm just going to give you a few close-ups here. Yeah, I love that guy. He's like, troops, go this way. This guy's awesome, awesome pose. This is Anrakir the Traveler or something like that. Trays in the Infinite. I don't know what it is. All right, this is the Necron Lord that we added. So anyway, uh, yeah, this is uh, up for sale. Not these particular models, just a portion of them, most of them, actually, um, that makes a 3,000-point army. Hey, Zana, tell us all about it. About what? What's about your painting? I want to see it. The big griffin thing. Uh, Deathclaw? Yeah. It's, uh, he wants it to be earth tones like in the book, but with more of a lion's right. body. So. There we go. That's a little better. Okay, fantastic. And you guys are almost in the home stretch with this. Yeah, we're looking at We're looking at Monday for yes. finishing it. And we're taking it to Valhalla next week. Awesome. Valhalla! Thank you. I should just keep like these stools in front of your painting station so I can just come and sit down anytime I want. That'd be awesome. So what are you doing today? Today I'm working on Empire Heroes, a bunch of level fives and a steam tank. And a freehand banner, so pretty cool. All right, awesome. It's gotta be a magical banner with a griffin motif. So. A magic banner with a yes. griffin motif? Yeah. Okay, I'm not great. Sure how that's gonna work yet, but it'll be good. Well, that was definitely interesting enough to not have to give a personal news story. Ooh, there's a steam tank too. Yeah. Come on, focus Check in. There out. she is. Hatch comes off. Yeah, this go ahead. Good. You can put a hatch like in the up position, the turret comes off, the top comes off, and there's actually an engineer that has his own base. Uh-huh. And so he can be on foot or he can go in the tank. So, pretty cool. Oh, that's awesome. Um, people, it what? It actually runs and blows steam out. <laughs> <laughs> that, that, that'd be awesome. Um, it is, no, it, it doesn't do that. I, I'm not saying no, it wouldn't be awesome because that would be awesome. So, oh, speaking of awesome, um, we, uh, uh, Sarah and I were plotting and planning as we usually are, and, uh, <laughs> We, she was like, Sean, what would be the ultimate thing for Valhalla that, you know, what would be like the crazy stuff, the craziest stuff you could think of? And uh, I was like, um, okay, Valhalla, the building is on a lake, not on the lake, it's like on the shore of a lake, right? And, um, and so when you arrive, you actually go down to the docks and a Viking longship rose up and there is a, there's a, there is a, uh, an actress dressed full on as a Valkyrie, like, and not corny, kooky stuff, like kind of cool, like Lord of the Rings type of, uh, type of uh, armor, and uh, and so you're bidden onto the longship, and uh, so your luggage is taken long way around by staff, and uh, you are rowed across this lake to Valhalla. That would be awesome. Hold, see, look at that. I know it's a good idea when there's some, oh my gosh, I was on tight that whole time. So who knows what people were seeing. Awesome. So anyway, I know it's a good idea 
when some gamer nerd gets like this Grinch-like smile on his face like, oh yeah, bing. Oh yeah, okay, hold on. And for the science fiction ones that we're gonna do, a full working, uh, a full scale working land raider, Space Marine land raider pulls up and you get on board the land raider through the front assault hatch. Right? See, look at him. Look at him. That would be ridiculously awesome, wouldn't it? And uh, yeah, and the land raider drives you to, uh, to the actual retreat. Yeah. That would be pretty cool. Right? You can have but, like incoming radio messages. Oh yeah, that would be like, awesome. Going on. Yeah, there's like a pilot up front. Oh, that that that'd be really neat. Like maybe there's like a big old chuck hole, and that's like that's like incoming fire or something like that. So anyway, yes, yes, the Disneyland of war gaming, the uh, something like so inspiring, and the hall doors are flanked by the Valkyries, right? Bam. Don't worry, there can be dark-haired Valkyries too. <laughs> Xana's like what? <laughs> Um, all right, I'm gonna have to edit that out. <laughs> what? Oh, okay, great. All right, it's staying on now. Look at her. Look at that crazy look. That's that's Zana's psycho look. She laughs. She laughs while her teeth are showing, and her eyes. You can see the whites on the tops and the bottom. You know that. You know that's when you've got Zana's attention, and uh, it might not be good attention. So, um, yeah. <laughs> Come on, give us, give us a psycho laugh, because they missed it. They missed already, it. Come on. They already got it. Yeah, Come but on. we didn't get to see it. It's already gone. I'm sorry. All right. She's not going to. No, no repeat performances. Hold on. I've got to get my focus out. So anyway, uh, yeah, I know I'm on to something when the person I'm telling it to gets this big, goofy smile on their face like, yeah, that would be awesome. Like, okay, what can we blow up next? Okay, so anyway, um, yeah, but see, all those things, for as outlandish as they sound, they're all quantifiable and achievable. You just have to work backwards and figure out, okay, well, what is it that you need to make this happen? What are the resources? What's the expertise? What is the capital that you need to put this together? And uh, then, of course, the big market demand question of, Will the market demand this? Is it sustainable? All right, let's move on. Uh, this is Josh. Hey. He just finished his one-week tryout, right? Yes. Yep. And nice. you, you were undaunted. You had a broken hand. So how did you break your hand? Boxing. All right, that's awesome. See, that's a cool thing. Mine would be like uh, I, was, <laughs> I was eating uncooked hot dogs out of the fridge and I slipped on a piece of bologna, you know, <laughs> and broke my hand in the, uh, on the crisper. <laughs> I was wondering where the hot dog plate ended up breaking your hand. <laughs> That's right. No, yep, because when you're eating hot dogs, you really can't concentrate on anything That's else. True. So uh, Josh is doing pretty good. Uh, here is some of his stuff. There you go. And you play Lizardman, right? Yeah, yep, I play Fantasy. I've been playing Lizard Man for like 12 years. I was like six when my dad started me. Okay, so. great. And and here you are, yeah, undaunted. I am. Hey, Stud, oh. it's your turn now. Oh, hi. All right. It's what's up. It's, uh, this is what's up. Blam! Yep, you sculpted that head, right? I did, I sculpted that head. And my first one. There and she blows. All right, great. You're working on some Orberos. Just getting going. Autumn Goal is to get them done today, right? Yep. And I'm also doing some Blood Ravens. Okay, fantastic. So, I'm excited. All right, thanks a lot. Yay! And here we see the Joseph in his native habitat. This is Ivana. This is, uh, in case you were wondering, this is Sarah's sister. Yep, Sarah does have a sister. <laughs> Joseph scratching his fleas. All right, fantastic. <laughs> what are you working on today, Stud? Um, some infinity. All right, we're gonna take a look. See if I can get it to focus here. Just, just hold it still. I bet I can do it. Yeah, there we go. Do you know what faction these guys are? Nomads. All right, awesome. This is the Reverend Custodia Hacker. Awesome. Can you teach me to play infinity? Because I need to learn. You need to get your army back. 
No, I've got Brat's Army. Oh. Yeah, that's yeah. the one I'm going to play. Infinity's fun. It's, uh, it's my favorite game, I think. Well, it's my favorite, like, skirmish game. Right. It's pretty cool. Okay. Anyway, so it's a 4-6 split. No. 4-5 split. So I'm excited about painting this because this is my faction. And I love Nomads. Awesome. So, anyway. All right. Sounds good.